the job ahead of them in the second half. This is Ochola. Will restart play. They've developed quite a good offloading game, the Kenyans. That's one of their tactics, take the ball to the line, look for the offload. We've seen two or three tonight that have led to tries. Now they hoist it high again. It's been knocked forward by Kenya. Now Japan attacks from inside their 22. Lokotui. They're under pressure. Now they're trying to break out of their 22. That's uh, Kuazuru, the number four. And uh, Uzuzuki. Out through the hands of Suzuki. Being closed down by the Kenyan defence. Going to ground was the number eight, Kabuki. Suzuki away for Suiki. Now Lokatui. Broke out of the tackle. Showed great strength. Suapeli Lokatui. And the pass back in field this time for Takahisha Uzuzuki. He comes to the 22, met by some solid Kenyan defence. They still maintain possession of the Japanese. And they're trying to spread it right, wide to the right. Now they've got a chance. Away for uh, Yamamoto. And finally, the try scorer is Kawazuru. Yasaku Kawazuru, who made his debut last year in Hong Kong. It's his third try in his IRB 7's career and it's a very timely one for the Japanese. Didn't rush things on the edge of the line then the Japanese side worked the ball into that far left corner maintained possession and then it was a simple case of numbers as the Kenyans had to rush themselves back into to the fence and get numbers around the ball through four sets of hands and the try on the edge. Nice, nicely worked try. There's still plenty of time left for Japan. Just under five minutes. Converted try here will put them within uh, three points. Number seven, three. Conversion was unsuccessful at 17-5. So they have to score two converted tries, basically to pull this game out of the fire. Time on. Kenyans have made a substitution here in the second half. The player that went to the bench was uh, Nato Sabuki. Now that's the 22 yard line. Kenyans into the ground. Innocent Simiu got the pass away brilliantly to uh, Mwanja. Great strength, he got the pass away to Onyango. Onyango got the ball back inside. Ah, oh, and Adrima scores a splendid Kenyan try, which will be obviously making the highlight trail run. That was a terrific try. The ball going through plenty of sets of hands down that right touchline. Any number of players getting back to support the breakout in the end. Vico Adema. He's the former under 17 captain. A couple of years ago, just 19 years of age. He showed plenty of pace. But this was terrific support play, wasn't it? Absolutely. Ball through lots of pairs of hands. Those, the offloading abil ability of the Kenyans. I mentioned it before. It's something they clearly work on in their game. The little pop pass. So that's probably put the ceiling on this match for Kenya. I can't see Japan coming back from this. So they will reflect on that win today against uh, the French in Kenya. After uh, being reasonably impressive against the South Africans, they only scored three tries against Kenya, the South Africans. Will also secure a win in their pool match as well. It's a poor restart.
Mark It'll give Japan the opportunity. Back Three in. minutes to go in this final match on day one for these two teams. Yamamoto. They spin it wide. And away goes Iwamoto and he loses the ball. Terrific cover coming from the Kenyans. Ochala coming across in cover. Did a great job. Just herded him into the corner. Was never going to score even if he held onto the ball. In the touch. Great piece of defence. You can hear this wonderful support of the Kenyans in this crowd at the Adelaide Oval. It's been a terrific first day. Tomorrow, of course, we see the cup to plate and the bowl decided for the eight top teams from the pools, the four pools who will go through to the quarterfinals of the cup. And then the minnows will line up against each other tomorrow. It's a very even contest right through the day tomorrow, Rod, and culminating with the final tomorrow night. Yeah, a lot to look forward to. Lockatui. Ball's lost forward, picked up. Chance for Kenya again. The quick to swoop. Innocent Simiu. Now they've got the numbers. Mawanja. Great strength. Got the pass back beautifully, but spilled by Onyango. And you can see he is disgusted with himself. Scrum. Red ball. All the hard work for nothing. Never a nice feeling, that white line fever with and the try line balance. beckoning. Mark. How well balanced is Bawanja. Yeah. Beautiful runner. Passed is a little high, but it should have been taken. Yeah, just snatched at it a bit. Got a bit right, big yeah. on him, a bit too quick. So the injured player Take it out. is uh, Kenji Sherman. He made his debut Come in 2003 on. in Brisbane, the last time that the Australian as a nation Ball. hosted an IRB Sevens Touch. tournament. Ball. Engage! This has been a terrific success. Stay. Speaking to Gary Flowers, the head of Australian Rugby, during the break, he was saying to me that this is a five-year commitment to Adelaide, and he's delighted with the support on day you one. And we are assured of bigger crowds here tomorrow on day two when this tournament is decided. And for South Africa, Fiji, New Zealand and Samoa, this is a very important tournament indeed as they battled for the IRB supremacy in 2006-2007. Now a turnover ball. On Yango. Denied a try just a moment or so ago. Into the final 20 seconds. Can Kenya cap off a terrific victory here with a bonus try. Adima, who scored a beauty yeah. earlier. Or will Japan have the last say? Away goes Showman. Oh, and a bad bounce. That cruel rugby ball. But away goes Uzuzuki. Last chance for Japan. They're keeping the ball alive. They trail by 22-5. Lokatui. They switch it again. Darting run. That time by Suzuki. Yankee run. came in with some solid defence. Now the Japanese again. Their skill levels are terrific. And they have the last say. So Suzuki scores Japan's final try. 22 points to 10 with the kick to come. And the try then to Atlanta, through 10. A spent force, Takashi Suzuki, scored a great try against the French in that upset victory earlier today. The kick is successful, so a 10 point victory to Kenya. So they finish the day in Japan with a win apiece with Kenya. And they look forward to playing for the minor trophy tomorrow. Kenya 22, Japan 12 at the Adelaide Oval.